your calendar tonight. It's gonna be a light hike. Light. Yeah. We gonna roll up. We gonna roll up. What's up, my peepers? My purpose? What's up, my purpose? Zone. Man, you better get back in here. <laughs> get back in here, man. You better get back What is here. up, y'all? This preacher Lawson in the building. I'm here. Good to see you. Welcome back to my channel. I love you and appreciate you. And today we gonna react to, uh, I don't know, man. This girl, this, okay. So I'm gonna just, I'm gonna go to my messages. I don't even know what I'm, I'm doing right now. So someone sent a message. This woman named, I'm not gonna, I guess I shouldn't put her full name out there. This is July 11th. She's like, hey, hi, looking good. How are you? Then, you know, July 14th, she goes, looking good. Then Friday, she goes, you're funny. And then Saturday, the next day, she says, don't quit your day job, LOL, right? I don't know what she was replying to. I, I guess she's replying to me on my story, whatever, when I do crazy stuff on my story. I don't know what I'm doing on my story. I just kind of go with the, I don't plan it. I just go with the, I was gonna say with the wind, but what does the wind have to do with my story? The wind has nothing to do with my story. What's up, Charles? Thanks for ruining my tape. Your tape? Does that mean, uh... I'm doing a reaction video and you ruined it. Uh, what, am I live? Yeah, you're live, bro. You're recording right now. Yo, Charles Engel, YouTube, right now. Best comic out there. Oh, my gosh. All right, man. He's the best comedian. You heard him. I mean, he's he's being modest, to be honest with you, because he's the only real comic, if we're being honest. The only real yeah. one. So it's like, how can you be the best when you're you're the only one that's real? You know? I'm kind of like The Last Jedi. Yeah, man. The Last Jedi. We got to protect Charles. Yeah, make sure, because I'm the funniest one left. But, uh, yeah, let's get back to <laughs> <laughs> I'm recording on my, I'm recording on my, in my, uh, in my studio. I'm about to, I'm doing a reaction. Okay, cool. All right, cool. I'll let you get back to that. So then, um, the next day she said, she says, don't quit your day job. Then the following day, she goes, you're ignorant. You don't reply. What? That's a reaction. <laughs> That's crazy, man. I don't know why she thinks I'm going to respond to her. I didn't see her first, you know, message, to be honest. Then Tuesday, fast forward a couple of days. You can't say how tall is your voice doesn't make sense. God's gift to women, not. I don't even know what that means. But I remember her saying a couple of days ago, because some woman said that I'm not as tall as my voice, right? And I was like, how tall is my voice? She's like 6'4". Because people think, you know, they... You know, people always are guessing my height. I know my height online says 5'9". I'm definitely taller than 5'9". But I'm not 6'4", which is my voice. I guess my voice is a 6'. She said my voice is like 6'4". I mean, right there. I mean, if you look at me. Look at me. Look at me. 5'9", bruh. I'm 5'9". She gonna tell me that my voice... This is it. <laughs> say, say what you just said. I'm gonna take my glasses yeah, off. Like your I feel like if I put my glasses on, you can't tell how big my forehead is. That's the only reason I got my glasses on. It's not like I'm trying to be cool, by the way. Someone tried to roast I my cool. glasses, too. I was too. just saying that his voice um, is misleading because it sounds like. My he's voice taller. is misleading? It sounds like he's taller. My like voice misleading? You got a tall man's voice. I'm a, listen, I ain't, I'm not short. You ain't short. Listen, but I am not. as tall as your voice is. How tall is my voice? <laughs> no, your voice about 6'4". <laughs> voice about 6'4". I got 6'4". She gonna... <laughs> she made me laugh because she said, voice on 6'4", body on 12. First off, your boy don't got no 12-year-old body. All right? All right? And also, my voice fit me. My voice fit me. I remember when I was, I was working for this, uh, I was selling these knives, right? Uh, from door to door, which is crazy now I'm thinking about it. I was selling knives. And uh, it was like, um, you know, you get in someone's house, you joke with them, and yeah. But anyway, so um, someone, when I was making calls, you know, unsolicited calls, uh, the my manager, the boss, he told me to make my voice not as deep so I didn't scare people. This is when I'm like 19, by the way. I thought that was crazy. He's like, make your voice, you like, you just, you might, you know, just kind of, have it a little higher. And I'm like, man, this is stupid, bro. Anyway, um, so Wednesday, the next day, I thought you was funny. First off, you don't know how to spell. Anyway, then today, she hits me up twice. You can't sing, don't quit your day job. And then she says, catches the worm. All right, whatever. So let's go uh, check out Miss Sarah. That's her name, Sarah. We're gonna look at Sarah 
All right, because obviously she a fan that want attention. So let's give her some attention. Let's give her a little bit of attention. You about to get all this attention, Sarah. Gonna try to roast me. All right, you already look like a Karen. I already know. You look like a Karen, all right? Your name is not Sarah, it's a fake profile. Let's see what else. Uh, you are in a relationship. Okay, obviously he ain't showing you enough attention because you in my DMs talking all that smack. All right. Okay. Works at Manchester. Okay. Well, let's see where you're. Okay. So you work at the Manchester Royal. Yeah. <laughs> Is this messed up? Okay. <laughs> I'm about to roast her whole profile. I, I think she's a fan, by the way. I think she's a fan, but she she was like, all this positive energy I'm sending his way isn't getting his attention. So let me go ahead and turn to a Karen. Okay. Let's let's check it out. She doesn't know. She doesn't smile. What? That better not be your boyfriend. That better not be your, your cover photo of this black dude. This your boyfriend? That better not be your boyfriend. I think that's her boyfriend. <laughs> I mean, why else would she have him? That's not her son. You know what I mean? Let's see. Okay. Well, maybe it is her son. Let's see what else got. She got that. Uh, she got a dog in a relationship March 14th. That's my birthday. She got in a relationship on my birthday. What a coincidence. That's why you're obsessed with me, man. I control your whole everything. You have met you, your relationship on my birthday? You trying to throw spite or something like that? Were you trying to hit on me? And then I hit on you back? And then you're like, oh, I'm just going to get, get a, a boyfriend on his birthday. Like I was going, no, huh? Wow. <laughs> Did you see that? <laughs> oh my gosh. Son, that's what, okay, that's the weird thing. So I, maybe she's a troll because it says in relationship on March 14th. It's two comments. I don't see any two comments. I see one comment. I see someone calling her a fat C word. <laughs> but you bleep that out, by the way. It's three people laughing, one like. She has one like on the relationship. Is this fake? I can't see much of her. They're not letting me see much. I wonder if she's a troll. She can't be a troll. Look at her. I just don't know why somebody's grandma would come on my page and just start disrespecting me with bad spelling. You know what I mean? That's just, I don't get it. But she's in uh, Joyce, Joyce then? I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right because it's from current in a relationship since August 2019. There goes all your siblings. <laughs> all right, well, that was fun. I just thought that was funny, man. I don't know. She's not giving me anything to roast her. I want to roast her, but she won't let me. I guess I'll talk to you about one more message. So this is, I don't really respond to messages. Like, I mean, especially on Facebook because Facebook is like, you know, it's just, I mean, it's just so many different social medias. This person, she was like, uh, I think I made a joke about punching a kid. And she said, sorry, but I witnessed my mom being punched in the face and a jaw break by my abusive dad when I was six. I usually laugh at all your jokes. You and Kevin Hart are my favorite comedians. I just can't laugh at this joke about violence. I said, when I was seven, I witnessed my mom go through some pretty crazy stuff. Way worse than getting her jaw broken. And I said, it was just a joke. Sorry, you couldn't laugh, but I hope you smile today. And she's like, sorry to hear that. I appreciate your reply. And I'm always smiling in my heart, even on cloudy day. That's great. That's great. But that's just uh, right there. When people message me, they're like, oh, I didn't want to laugh because this reason. It's like, cause that, that affected you. Like, it doesn't like, I don't know. You got you to gotta see what something like that, like punching in the face. I don't know. You got to see what offends you. I mean, you got to you got to you have to know what to let roll off your shoulder, you know? Like when you see Floyd fight, he likes things roll off his shoulder. Like some things, you just let it roll off. Like the punching, I mean, me punching a kid. I'm not obviously not gonna punch a kid for real, but like you, you, you. How does that like a punch remind? I get, I guess a punch of your dad punching your mom. Anytime someone punches, that's what you think of. I mean, that's a lot. I mean, there's like boxing matches. UFC is the only, you know, pretty much uh, MMA is the only sport that's open. UFC is the only people that are running things. So you see a lot of punching and kick. I mean, like anytime you see a highlight of something, like, is that what you think of? I don't know what's going on. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I think that, that's it, all I'm talking about today. And uh, I was gonna roast her, but she wouldn't give me any material. So if you want me to roast you, um, go ahead and leave uh, links to your social media in the comment section and I will roast you. Also, uh, just cause I went and did this, there's gonna be a lot of people that disrespect me in my messenger because they're trying to get attention and it's not gonna work. I just wanna let you know, I don't reply to this. I just thought it was really funny. But thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Let me know what you want me to react to next. Go ahead and follow me on other social medias like Twitter, TikTok, Facebook, YouTube. I already, we're on YouTube. Instagram, all that. 
and I'm out. That was the video, and I hope you enjoyed watching it. And if you did, maybe subscribe, and maybe click on the left or the right.